Hey guys, it's Snowy. So today I want to talk about a story. Yes, a story of my life. Go figure. But um, for the last four days or five days, I don't know. It's today's Thursday, and I think like since like Friday last week. I've been in so much pain on my foot that it's not even funny. I just don't recall or falling or twisting my ankle. It's not the ankle. I'll show you in a little bit, but I think I discover why it hurts. And even though that you're gonna get shock and you're gonna be like, what the hell is wrong with the deformed foot? Yes. I have to say the truth. I have a very deformed foot. It's not pretty. Um, I think that's one of the reasons why I don't wear sandals. Uh, well, I only wear sandals once in a while, in the summer, not in the winter, because it will be cold though, you know? So a couple of months ago, I think like way before Christmas, so it's been, well, wait a minute, Christmas, it was just last month. Oh my God, what am I thinking? Um, before Halloween. Was it before Halloween? Yeah, it was way before Halloween. So I was at a friend's house and um, I twisted my ankle and hit my back pretty, pretty bad. And I still have some pain in my back, but it's kind of like, almost gone a little bit. I've been trying to like, I've been stretching. I'm not gonna say that I've been doing yoga or anything like that. I try, but it's very, very painful, especially when I wake up in the morning. It's, uh, this foot, it's insane. Now, like, not yesterday, like over Monday or Tuesday, whatever, I was like looking at my foot and I'm like, oh my God. Probably I know why my foot hurts so much. And I think I discovered the reason why. When I was like 10 years old or 12, I can't remember exactly how old I was. I think it was like 10 or 12. But uh, my dad uh, used to have this business where they would buy like metal scraps and like cardboard and stuff like that and they resell it, you know, to other companies, whatever. So we used to have like this machine, you know, that compresses or compacts the cardboard. Um, it kind of like looks like this, but the, the, see like these things, I don't know, we call them pacas, I think. But, um, so there were like tons of them, like, you know, Sometimes in any given day, you can see like 50, 60, probably 100. You know, I was playing around and jumping around and at one of those jumps, I fell. And there was like this, what is it called? Like a rake or a rake, 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 I don't know. It looks like a big fork, like a big ass fork. And it has these tentacles that are so hard and pointy. So it was like this. And I landed in the damn thing. And obviously it went through my foot and it went through my toe and it was not pretty. Uh, I remember my mom, you know, she was like all freaking out and I don't know how the hell, you know, like she left me because I, I have always been a very heavy boy, but uh, that's not the case. Uh, she, took me immediately to the hospital and like find out what the hell is going on with me, you know. Uh, they did a couple stitches and everything, but like this thing went through my foot like that. And it's been a couple of days that it just hurts like right there in that specific spot. And it's like every time that I just put pressure, I can feel, it's like putting a nail to your you know, not to the toe, like to the tip of your, or this part of your foot. I don't know what's it called. But I'm gonna show you, don't freak out because it's very freaky. Um, yeah, don't say that, oh no, why you don't have a pedicure? No, because it's not summer, it's really not worth it, I think, to get a pedicure. So my nails look like shit. So here we go. So this is my foot. This is my, this is my fat foot. This is my left foot and it's pretty fat. I have like, 
cow ankles. <laughs> cow ankles. Oh, so cute. Uh, but look at. I don't know if you. Oh, I don't know if the camera is gonna. Come on, fucking camera. Focus. Can I just point it at the thing, maybe? Oh, there we go. So I don't know if you can see. It's like right here. So this thing went through here and through this toe. It didn't came out like my this piece was like oh like stretching because it was really bad. So right now I've been having like a lot of pain like exactly right here and it's like super warm. Um, I'm not sure why. I've been having like so many injuries on my feet that see this is like my other deformed foot. On this one, look at this scar. It's like huge. I would tell you what I did with that scar. So that big one, I used to have a dog. It was like um, Lassie with Grain Dane. I don't know, it was like a mix. It was a big ass dog. So hairy, so beautiful. But it did look like Lassie. Um, he was like the best dog ever. I cried so much when he died. Um, it was a sad moment. I don't have photos of the dog, which is sadder, but what can you do, right? Um, I remember the dog, you know, waiting for me uh, on the bus stop every freaking day. He was the nicest dog. Um, I think he was so nice because I used to feed him very well. So like every other day, so like every second day or whatever, I used to go to this place, to this, uh, uh, restaurant or like this butcher whatever you call it and uh, collect all the scraps you know like the guy will like, have him ready for me and I mean I used to buy them for him for like so so cheap uh, I don't know it was probably like a couple of pesos you know and so it was like a huge bag like huge huge bag so I will cook that I will boil it and I'll put like you know some piece of carrot and stuff like that um, but mostly it was just the, the scraps, you know, it's like the meat, the chicken and stuff like that. And I will feed this to the dog, you know, like a soup. And one of those days I was with this big pot. I mean, the pot, it was like one of those pots used for tamales. Uh, if you don't know, Google it because they're fucking big. And, um, so trying to pour this hot freaking soup for my dog um the thing just like literally like i don't know i slept or something and it fell all over my freaking feet uh i was wearing like shoes and it just like it burned so i'm like screaming and my mother's like what the hell take your shoes off hello <laughs> because and your socks everything because it was not pretty. So I got these blisters the size of a football, uh, well more like a tennis ball because I had little feet. I was like little. Was it before or after this accident? I can't remember. I think it was like eight or nine when that happened but uh I still have like you know like <laughs> that scars of battle or something. I don't know. So that's why I can be a foot model. That is the reason why I am stuck not being a model. Um, anyway, so I already talked too much about my feet. I hope you're having a fantastic day. It is Friday and I love you. Don't forget to subscribe and like because you know what? I like you. Mm. I'm gonna talk to you guys about something that I think it's a great benefit for everyone because if you drive a car, if you put gas in your car, um, aside of, you know, like any type of rewards, uh, this is about rewards. Um, aside of any type of rewards that you get with your credit card, you can also get, now this is very like, I had no idea. So I got this card, this is like, oh, focus. Okay, here we go. So I got this card, this is from BP, it's like a driver rewards. And I got it last 